good YouTube welcome back to my channel it is your boy smoke and on today's video we're gonna be going over Tyler Crater spring slash summer 2020 golf wing drop if you guys remember I had already did a review on the first drop that he had did like a couple months back if you would like to watch that I will leave links somewhere around here and I also caught some clothes from that drop because he actually has some pretty fire stuff on that drop but this second drop is really what I've actually been waiting for this entire time because I feel like bro has absolutely outdid himself this time. So of course, I'm basically just gonna be going over all the items and pieces that catch my attention basically. No, I would not be going over every piece that he has. If you would like to see everything that he has, you can always just search it up yourself at golfwing.com. So if you're new to the channel, make sure that you go ahead, hit that like button and hit that subscribe button and turn on that post notifications bell so you never miss my drop another bit. And other than that, let's go ahead and get to the video. So the first item that caught my eye was the flannel zip up shirt. Now this off the rip had instantly caught my attention, but it mostly caught my attention like mostly for the color. For me, the color pattern was just like, it was so, I just felt so preppy in a way. I really didn't care for the orange flannel. I actually care for the blue flannel more because my favorite color is blue. I like to wear a lot of blue. This is literally blue. You know what I'm saying? Like I love blue. To me, that flannel just looks so much better. Next up we got is the crochet camp shirt. Now, this right here has to be one of my favorite shirts that he has put out for this second drop. Mostly because I love the fact that he's like, I don't even know, I feel like bro is actually trying to experiment with his clothing brand and all that stuff because I feel like we've never really, like maybe I might be wrong, but I feel like we've never really bought anything from Golf Wang where it's like, oh, he's, it's like all knitted up. Everything's all knitted up. All the cotton is like that. It's built like that. You know what I'm saying? That type of material. It's always, you know, a regular t-shirt, something, you know, kind of like the same that we always, you know, we're used to. So the fact that I'm seeing that Tyler, the creator has this vision and he's setting this vision to like, to put it into this, I feel like that's super cool. And I just love it. I personally don't know what all the colors that he have in it. Seems like right here you can tell that the colors for the first one is white, brown, black, and it also looks like there's a little bit of pink in there. While in the second one, it looks like he uses orange, black, blue, and white. Me personally, I would go with the first one just because I feel like it will suit me and it'll look better on me than the orange one. But both of these are absolutely like really cool and it's different so yeah i really like both of these a lot next we got the clip polka dot shirt now the only reason that i put the clip polka dot shirt in this video and i say it stands out to me mostly because i feel like this shirt is like tyler trying to bring back some of his old ways if you catch my drift if you are a og tyler creator fan you know that tyler creator style was very vibrant in multiple ways he always had his button up shirts, but it always had the little patterns, whether it was the cat with the upside down cross on his forehead, or he had dots, or he or any type of pattern, he always had some on the button up shirt. But I'm not gonna lie, for some reason, when I look at this button up shirt, I instantly think of Cherry Bomb. I feel like this would totally fit Tyler in his Cherry Bomb era. Me personally, I don't think that I would get it because, you know, I don't wear stuff like that. I'm not gonna lie, I used to wear a lot of button up shirts that had designs like this on back then, but it's not really my thing now. I don't really wear stuff like that, but I do think that this is really cool and I like it. And I love that, you know, if other if I see someone else wearing this, I would think that is so freaking awesome. And I would like, you know, that would be cool. But on me, I feel like I just look goofy with it. The next item we have is the playground hoodie. Now, when you look at it like this, it honestly just looks like a regular playing hoodie, of course. But the only reason why I like the hoodie so much and it stands out to me is only because I like the green hoodie. That hoodie right there is nice. But I mostly just like this hoodie because of the green hoodie. It just looks so chill. It looks aesthetically pleasing, if that makes sense in this, in what I'm talking about here. But this would definitely be something that I would love to cop in the future. And the last thing that I would say is most likely just his hats. I don't know why, but I'm obsessed with Tyler Creator's hats. He always have the best hats out here when he'd be dropping his golf wing brand. And even though sometimes it looks like it don't fit my head right, my head is not big. 
I still end up looking at the hats and I still appreciate it for the designs and just how it stands out and what it looks like. But that is pretty much all I have to choose from. If you guys think that I missed out on something or you think that I should have replaced something with something else, then please make sure that you let me know in the comments below. If you copped anything from the second drop, make sure you guys tell me what you got. If you copped anything from the first drop, also make sure you guys let me know what you got. Man, I would love to know what you guys have. So if you enjoyed this video, make sure that you press this like button and hit that subscribe button and turn on your post notification bell so you never miss when I drop another video, bro. And other than that, golf going forever, it's been your boy Smokey.